Good morning, happy Monday everybody. 24 hour temperature cast, a little different today, starting a little warmer and going to get a little warmer this afternoon too. Wouldn't surprise me at all to see region-wide mid-80s this afternoon, especially if we hang on to decent amounts of sunshine. I don't really see any new energy making it to the southeast just yet. Got some energy over South Florida, that's stuck down there. Anything way out to the west is stuck way out there. So for us, for another day or two, or maybe even three, we're just going to notice things gradually get a little bit warmer and gradually get a little bit more humid, and that likely means we're going to gradually pick up a few more clouds. Starting at 56 in Tallahassee this morning with some patchy fog, we're at 55 degrees in Thomasville, and we're at 57 degrees in Valdosta, also some patchy fog. It's really our eastern areas that I see the most fog this morning. I think we can find some more fog in more spots tomorrow morning. I suspect the vermin will be out there lurking, so if you are going to be out making a morning commute tomorrow, be very careful on that road. And even this morning, some of our eastern areas, the I-75 corridor, visibilities are going to be a little bit reduced. Most of our numbers, mid-50s, got a lot of 55s in Quincy and Thomasville and Moultrie and Tifton, Madison High School, Lafayette High School, and Cross City, all starting off at 55. And here are some of those visibilities I was talking about. Valdosta and Homerville down to just one quarter mile. So yeah, we've got some of that fog. We're likely going to find a little bit more over the next few mornings as we slowly increase the humidity. Now, that means we also increase the cloud cover. Warmer air surging north on the eastern third of the country. There is a cool front and there is cooler air back out towards the Rocky Mountain states. Eventually, that will make progress east and how quickly that happens. We'll adjust our forecast for the end of the week. But that's the end of the week. For the first part of the week, it's going to just get warmer, going to get a little bit more humid. We're going to cook up a few more clouds. We're going to hope for some more scattered showers. It was nice that at least some areas got a few yesterday morning. I hope we can find a few more on Wednesday, maybe a better chance on Wednesday to get some more widespread scattered showers. I still don't think we're talking about big time soaking rains, which is really what we could use. But maybe Wednesday, that's our next shot. Winds on the Gulf today, by the way, looking pretty good. Less than 12 knots, seas less than 2 feet, and looks like we're wrapping up those high tides this morning. All right, 50s and 60s are going to quickly turn into 70s and 80s, and I think today most of us are going to climb into those middle 80s. Let's hopefully hold off those upper 80s till tomorrow. It is going to get a little bit more summerish feeling outside, and I do think the rain chances will slowly increase a little bit maybe up to a 20 or 30 percent shot tomorrow, maybe more like a 50 or 60 percent chance on Wednesday. So there are chances to see some showers, but guys, it's still not that big soaking that I know we need.